Ready to go. We built a wireless guitar system and it starts out with the transmitter. There's an accelerometer in here, sense motion. So it just slides right onto the little strap peg of your guitar. Plug it in. When you pick up your guitar, it senses the motion, it wakes up your amplifier, and you can also have like another pedal plugged in over here or something like that. It wakes all that up for you automatically. So basically you can pick up your guitar and just start playing. And now once it's in the operating mode, we've also built in a tilt sensor with the accelerometer. So you're playing, you can tilt it up and it'll turn on a distortion. And then you can keep playing with it distorted and then tilt it again and it'll turn it back off. If you then put it back down, let it rest for like 15, 20 seconds, it'll time out. And you can pick up a different guitar that also has a transmitter and you can switch the input to that guitar. So you can have like a different tuning on the other guitar and just change between those really easily and the distortion effects works on all those guitars. And for our design constraints, we just want it to be light. It's pretty light. You can Put it on the guitar, you can't really feel the end of it. Hold on. The end of it. So, I'm going to try it out. Let's see if it works. It was working earlier. Holy crap. Yeah, this one is going to be mounted on the guitar. It's been spotty. It was working fine earlier. Oh, what's going on now? Uh oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, it was working earlier, 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 and then, I don't know, yeah, I, we're messing with it, I guess. Do you have any oh, video sure. over there to demo yeah, it, it's working? We got the yeah, we have a video. Yeah. video. And I saw it earlier. But. Yeah, we were walking around with it earlier. What? That doesn't matter? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, sure. For my eyes only. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> you're the judge, you're, you're the earlier. judge. We were playing with it. You don't want to watch the video? I can't hear it. But yeah, right, uh, what's going on? Well, like, what happens, like, it, it, it tries to connect, and then I guess someone from the relay trip, it, like, resets the circuit. And it's whenever the, it's energizing the relay coil, and I guess it somehow it's drawn too much power or something, and it's resetting so it's our... permanent shut off? Shut off. No, it, it, like, what happens is the circuit no, just resets. Every time it tries to connect. Just like, every time it connects. It's like a transient, just, like, real fast, and it resets, like, our controller. And, like, so how long does it take? For it to come back on. Well, no, it resets instantly. Sounds kind of grungy here.
So is it picking up a lot more noise than it? Because it sounds like it's picking up a lot more noise than it was earlier this morning. Next to one at a time. Yeah. So once the other one times. I think that's so. just part of the discussion. Uh, well, there's a lot of wireless projects on the other side of the room, so I figured. Right now, yeah, it'll tell you. It's an operating mode, and when it times out, it goes to the idling. Yeah, see. Yeah, yeah, idling, and it turns off the amps. Now the amps, the amps off for you. So how, okay. How do the radios or whatever work? The frequency? It's a, we have it says 107. Yeah, so actually, we're using FM uh, receiver module in the receiver, and we have FM transmitter in our guitars. And basically, what happens is we can set it, we tune a station, like a like, you know, I, you have the MP3 player ones, personal ones, and you can just tune a station and like, plug in with the player. We're trying to use borrowing that logic. So we're pretty much trying to find a, a clear radio station, and you, you program that into your receiver. And then when you pick it up, it automatically transmits through the XPs what stations it's broadcasting on, and trying to pick up on. And then this will program, tune our uh, guitar to that station, so you can play on that one. We're going to see. All right. So yeah, you can actually kind of use it as a radio, too, if you really want to. Yeah, you can make it a yeah. radio. If you turn off their transmitter, then you can use it as a radio. <laughs> Just listen to radio. <laughs> yeah, we can try it, yeah. That one's, that one's on idle already. You can turn it on. Anybody have a radio? <laughs> yeah. It's an operation mode. Good. Once it gets safe, it's like... 99.5. 99.5. Yeah. <laughs> The, the only classic uh, rock station in town. <laughs> no, I remember. Really you mean your awesome uh, antenna is not? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not all the way out. It's not all the way out. It's super long. That's yeah. why. <laughs> no, it's, it's not. It's not really worth it. Right now. All right. We were, we were messing with that in the lab where we can just like. That's another. That's an extra added bonus feature that wasn't. It's kind of something you don't want. Not really. <laughs>